here is that we have an aircraft in three flights, and uh, uh, you can navigate through the different views and get into the virtual cockpit where you can actually zoom in and do things like turning on the GPS or modifying the avionics. Um, the game itself, we have a variety of things. If you jump back to the map, which we see as our hub, you can jump into experiences such as we have a whole list of challenges here that range from like landing challenges to hoops courses to these things we call Gold Rush, which is kind of like token collection missions. Uh, we're featuring two planes here at the show, the Boeing Stearman or the Icon A5. And that's one that you worked exclusively with Icon for, right? We did. It's an amphibious aircraft. It's set to go into production at the end of the calendar year. Uh, it can land on water or an, uh, on land, so it makes it a fun aircraft to fly and feature in Hawaii. Is there more aircrafts in the actual beta? Uh, in the beta, we have the two, those two aircraft that were featured. Okay. Um, so this is just a normal beta copy? It's no yeah, right, right here we're just featuring sure. the normal beta copy. This is the first time we've actually publicly shown the beta. Okay. Uh, so the beta right now is closed. We're opening up to an increasing amount of people every every day at MicrosoftFlight.com. And what you see here is an example of what we call a gold rush mission, where I'm trying to collect a number of tokens in a set number of times. And what you have here is something that you can, using the uh, live platform, log in and connect with your friends and compare the results and stats. Uh, that get featured on your pilot profile that grows in the play the game. Okay, and, and how does the uh, Xbox controller work on this one? The Xbox controller, we really wanted to build a game that's about building a uh, approachable experience to everybody. So I can control the aircraft with an Xbox controller. Uh, we focused a lot on the different control experiences between the mouse, the keyboard, the Xbox controller, or even a joystick, or one of the many other uh, rudders and pedals that you may have from other flight simulation games. So, you know, the, the uh, bumpers here control your throttle, the uh, different flaps and rudders are controlled by the, the triggers, and the, I can even use the right stick at certain viewpoints to look around. So can you, um, is there going to be any connect integration with this? Uh, uh, for, for our initial release, there's no connect integration plan, but with the recent announce of connect for Windows, uh, we're going to be listening to our customer base and looking to uh, interesting uh, opportunities uh, based on the feedback of what they provide for us.